It's gimmicky, yet very cool. Today I'm going to look at the new Bluetooth-enabled Rubik's Cube as found in Xiaomi's Media Yopin store. Let's go! So this Rubik's Cube came out a little while ago. It's a uh, headphones wearing Rubik's Cube that's got a very nice mechanical clicky feel to it. And the headphones looking thing actually has a micro USB port to charge it. So right after unpacking it, I had to scramble it just to get reminded how frustrating it actually is not to be able to solve it. Well, the great thing about this Rubik's Cube is that it's got a Bluetooth connection that allows you to pair it to a phone to play games. But also, yes, you can solve this Rubik's Cube in about the 40, 50, seconds using your smartphone. So how this works is uh, pretty easy. Download the Puzzle Solve app on your Android or iOS device and pair the cube using Bluetooth. I've made the mistake of scrambling it before I paired it the first time so it was out of sync with the app. Luckily you can actually manually recalibrate the app to match your cube. So I've quickly done that and hopped over to the quick solve menu where I found out how quickly you can actually solve this cube. Just have the red and blue centerpieces facing towards you and the white centerpiece on top and follow the animations on screen. The app will notice if you follow along correctly and will automatically show the next step once you completed yours. It took me about uh, 40 seconds to get it solved and uh, yeah that was pretty awesome just for that it's totally worth it yeah so that's that but in the app you can also learn how to actually solve it without the need for the app which seems like a really cool way to actually learn how to solve it but you can also play games to start climbing up the charts so overall i think this bluetooth enabled rubik's cube is really cool if you want to learn how to solve these things um, the cube itself feels really nice that mechanical clicky feel just feels pleasing and nice to turn and the fact that you can simply just solve it by pairing it to the app that made me really love this they also released a non-Bluetooth version that's just a plain old Rubik's Cube, but come on, that Bluetooth makes it cool. So if you're like me and you have zero interest in learning how to solve it, but every once in a while use it as a type of fidget spinner, but you do want to be able to have it solved without getting overly frustrated by your own failure, well, this might be the Rubik's Cube to have. Also, if you want to play competitively because you are one of those people that can actually solve these things in a few seconds, or if you want to learn how to master the art of the cube, then this might be your next Rubik's Cube as well. Bottom line, this thing is actually pretty cool. I've put some links down in the description where you can buy these Rubik's Cubes online outside of China, so you can check them out if you're interested. So that's it for the Bluetooth enabled Rubik's Cube. Let me know down here in the comments section what your thoughts are and if you maybe plan to pick one up. If you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and perhaps you should subscribe to the channel if you have not done so yet as always thank you guys for watching and i hope to see y'all soon peace